Hey guys, let's talk about Sherry Ann Mahan. Sherry was born on August 14th, 1976, and she's been missing since February 22nd, 1985, from Cabot, Pennsylvania. At the time of her disappearance, she was 8 years old, 4 feet 2, and 68 pounds. She's a Caucasian female with brown hair and hazel eyes. She has a dog bite scar on her left arm. Her left arm was previously broken below her left shoulder, but the injury had healed before her disappearance. She has a cowlick on the right side of her hair. Her hair was slightly longer at the time of her disappearance than in the photos in this video. Her ears are pierced. Sherry was last seen getting off the bus from her elementary school at around 4.05 p.m. on February 22, 1985. Three other students got off with her at the stop. She was about 100 to 100, 150 yards along a dirt driveway from her family's residence on Corn Planter Road in Cabot, Pennsylvania, at the time she disappeared. When she failed to arrive home, her stepfather went looking for her and called the police when he failed to find her. Sherry has never been heard from again. A bright blue or green 1976 Dodge van was seen in the area at the time of her disappearance and may be connected to her case. The van was following the school bus Sherry had been riding in. The van had a snow-capped mountain and skier mural painted on both sides of the vehicle. The skier was wearing red and yellow clothing and was skiing down the mountain. The van has never been located or identified, and investigators are still not sure if it was connected to her case. A small blue car was also seen near the site of Sherry's disappearance. It's unknown if the car has anything to do with her case either. According to her mother, Sherry was conceived through RAPE when her mother was 16 years old. The police didn't believe the RAPE allegation and Sherry's biological father was never charged. She believes people connected to Sherry's father were involved in her disappearance. Her father maintains his innocence in her case. Sherry's family had her declared legally deceased in 1992. They donated the life insurance policy they received to the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children and put a car accident settlement she had received into a trust fund for her brother. Sherry's case has never been solved. Some agencies state she disappeared from Saxonburg, Pennsylvania. If you have any information, please call the Pennsylvania State Police at 412-284-8100.